Hi everyone. Over the past several days, I've noticed many of you telling stories about how proud you are to be taking care of growing plants or of pets in your home. This is something that I'm working on here at my house too. It reminds me of something that you all helped me create for Sprout and how to keep track of what those plants in Sprout need. Um, we all worked together on the cover for the garden log for Sprout, which tells us who and when and what was done to take care of the things that are living in Sprout. This has inspired me to, to do something here at home to keep better track of the care I'm taking of my seeds that I have here in front of me. And so I, I've gotten here, I've got a blank piece of paper. You could use anything though. You could use your notebook or you could use a clipboard or, or anything that you think might work. But, but I'm going to title this um, Miss Kenny's Garden Log. And this is where I'll keep track either for myself or for the other people that live in my home, the who, the what, and the when of the care that's needed for these seeds that I have planted here. So the first thing I might notice is what date these, these happen to be cucumbers, um, these seeds were planted. And so I might write that digital date down first for 11 or April 11th and say seeds planted. Now that was a few days ago and I might not have everything between then and now that I've done, but I'm going to start keeping better track now. So today is 4 15 is April 15th, and I know that I, Miss Kenny, watered seeds. This record is something I'm sure I will add to over the next couple of days. It might be something you're interested in trying at home for your seeds or for your dog or your cat or your fish or anything else that you're taking care of. It might help your family know um, who's done what so that it doesn't happen twice in one day or that a day isn't forgotten. And um, I'll be excited to keep you posted about what I've been working on here and, and see how it might work for you. <laughs> 